Hi guys, welcome to this short video about the question what I think is the biggest advantage of the Moboy Tic Watch 3 Pro Ultra compared to the Fossil Gen 6 smartwatches. I mean, they are pretty much using the same CPU, same RAM. So the differences are really minimal. I mean, the Tic Watch is a little bit larger. It has also a larger battery, but because of the larger screen, the advantage of the larger battery is not so much and what I'm missing here is of course the crown a little bit and the nice style of the fossil I mean uh, the fossil they have a, a couple of different options you can even buy different brands you can even buy from Michael Kors or so and it's still fossil gen 6 but what's the big advantage uh, based on my experience? I mean, I am having this watch since about four months and my wife has the Fossil Gen 6. It's actually Michael Kors since four months. And so we have the chance to compare them almost every day. And I don't see a lot of advantages from the tick watch i mean the fossil has even a better waterproof rating and again the advantage of the battery runtime is not much i mean i'm usually getting a day maybe one and a half and it's exactly same as what my wife gets with her uh, fossil or michael course with same settings so what do i think is the big advantage here of the moboy tick watch compared to the fossil and i think that's the charger when i looked at these two watches at the beginning i was thinking okay it's a huge advantage for the fossil because uh, at first i mean i thought it's a wireless charger it looks almost like a wireless charger but it's definitely not it has magnet inside unfortunately i don't have the fossil watch here but, but the fossil does not only have pins they have a full circle like the pins uh, the two pins are two circles and it centers here and then no matter how you hold it it's supposed to make contact and charge and this is what it's actually not doing very reliable and so my wife has found her watch a couple of times in the morning absolutely discharged and not fully charged and that's a huge bummer of course when you want to rely on the watch during the day and you don't have it fully charged in the morning and this really has happened a lot and you can find a lot of similar reviews and complaints online I can tell you it looks like either here's a problem of the charger or in the back maybe I mean there's a full circle of, of metal and when you're sweating or so maybe there's some corrosion and it doesn't make any contact anymore and with these small pins of course they can use much better material because the area is so small so they can invest in much higher or better quality material so it doesn't corrode and the thing is here that's so fast so quick i mean when you're coming from the side i can tell you it's almost impossible that you miss the charging pins and i never had the situation that it was not charging and usually i mean of course now it's not happening but usually you will see a sign that it's charging that's also much better i mean it's charging now we can see that here it's not the case that it's not charging but for some reason it doesn't show the charging circle usually when you connect the watch like this it will show a charging circle i mean that's happening in 99 percent of all the cases now it has done it maybe it just took a little bit longer i don't know but i would say 99 percent of all the cases when i come with the charging magnet here it goes into this charging circle where you really can see that it's charging and with the fossil it's not doing that in a lot of times then it's difficult to see is it charging or not and in a lot of cases it's not charging and then you don't have your watch ready when you think it should be ready and this is not happening here so this is then actually at the very end but the much more reliable watch and this is what i wanted to let you know and i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below and I'm always happy to talk about these things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.